Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Monica, if you are new here. Uh, on today's video, I don't know how to even start that. Uh, definitely, it will be video about comparing two um, big, hmm, how to say, two controversial companies. Stay with me. So as a first, I want to tell you, uh, this review is 100% honest from me. This is my private toss, what I think about some brand. We will compare two companies together and why it's so important to review that. Just because you ask me many times about company number one, company number two, and they look on my opinion very similar, which is not nothing bad, nothing wrong, but I want to put some challenge on both of these brands and check if they are same quality or not. The most important is they are from two different countries. One com company number one, it's original from Sweden where I live, and another one is from USA, exactly Los Angeles. Um, so yeah, okay, I will just tell you what is the thing because already you wanna know. Uh, just wanna say one more thing. Uh, if you search some kind of drama on my YouTube channel, I don't think you will find it uh, because um, I'm not here to offense any company. I'm here just to tell you um, you know, just to review some product, uh, that's it. So if you was <laughs> thinking it will be so drama in here or I will say some bad things about some product, mm, I don't think so. I always uh, say how it works for me, but I will never offend any company because they already work hard to deliver some product for us. So, okay, let's do this tutorial. Ding! So they are these two companies what we will review uh, today. I will put them on me, I will try them, I will tell you prices and all that kind of jazz. They look very similar as you can see. Kaya Cosmetic, it is Swedish brand created in Italy, I do believe. And um, KKW Beauty, it's a USA brand created in Los Angeles, I think, yes. I think so, yeah. So, what is the deal? Why it's so important to review? It's not just because they look similar, guys. Kaya Cosmetic, the owner of Kaya Cosmetic, it is Bianca Ingrosso. Bianca Ingrosso is the famous, for now, uh, in Sweden um, person. And behind KKW Beauty, it is famous, one and only KKW, <laughs> Kim Kardashian. So I don't have to introduce to you Kim Kardashian, of course, but but I want to show you who is Bianca Ingrosso. So this is Bianca Ingrosso. She have 1.1 million followers. She's very famous. She was in Dance with the Stars program. Um, she's all the time on the Swedish uh, TV program. Uh, they show all her life. It's almost like Kim, uh, Kim Kardashian or Kardashian's family because include it's also her mother, uh, which is very famous, lovely, talented woman, uh, singer, and her father have uh, restaurants in Italy, in Grosso, and uh, her brother, she have two, three brothers, so they are also on TV, except the smallest one, <laughs> not yet, but I do believe it's some place for him as well. So this is a very famous family, and uh, let me show you some so, and this is Bianca by herself. I hope you can see this good. Uh, I think she's a very beautiful young woman. I think she have 24 years old, um, but I don't want to lie to you. I'm not so intensive 
on exactly Bianca so I don't know the story with her age I think she's 24 I'm not sure but you can check that out if you're interesting definitely you can see her on YouTube she's a big youtuber as well she she show us everything behind uh, um, you know on TV when they film something for her or, or you know she take us everywhere with her uh, so I think uh, it's very nice it's very interesting for normal people like me or maybe you uh, who don't know anything about industry um, so yeah this is what I just want to tell you about the Bianca Ingrosso and uh, Kim Kardashian of course you know already so uh, I love Kim Kardashian and um, yeah I just I'm very excited for this review actually it was uh, why since I want to review and compare these two companies so let's start uh, same KK like uh, Kaya Cosmetic they create four different shades I had two and I have with me uh, this is uh, classy and classy and edgy from uh, Kaya Cosmetic and light medium from KKW Beauty I think this is also light and medium, I think so, I'm not sure. Uh, let's open them up. So, I have in here, I think this is medium, classy, it's medium uh, palette they had, light. And this one, it's light from KKW Beauty. Uh, they look very similar. I have to be honest with you, when I was ordered this palette, I was thinking I would receive size this one. Uh, but they are much smaller and uh, if we open them out they are not necessarily the same in Sweden there are many girls who say like Bianca Ingrosso copy Kim Kardashian but I don't think so uh, she's girl where she search uh, inspiration uh, everywhere and I do respect that I don't think it's nothing wrong Ooh. and I don't think this palettes they are the same uh, maybe they look a little bit but uh, in here we have uh, two bronzers we have blush and highlighter on KKW Beauty you don't find any blush we have two bronzers and we have two highlighters so there is the different automatic right now if we will have blush in here and we have blush here mm, who knows maybe it will be like yeah somewhere was a little bit tea but um, I think we don't have that definitely size is also different uh, I think it's many companies who have that idea to put bronzers and highlighters together in square palettes um, so we have information about company in here in here it's also about very light I don't know if camera will catch that behind like behind we have also information about palette product by itself and stuff like that uh, Okay, I will open darkener one. I ordered dark darkener one from Kaya Cosmetic just because I really love this uh, kind of goldy champagne highlighter. We will try this soon. And this is medium palette from KKW Beauty. Once again, I think on both palettes, um, shades of bronzers, they are warm. They are pretty too warm for me if I'm not tan. If I'm pale like now, I cannot use them because they are too warm, too yellow, both of them. If I like them, yes, I do like them and I will present them for you today. I think on the site, this site will belong to KKW Beauty. I will go with the medium because this, I don't know honestly who can use that shade. It's very kind of orange, like a orange. So I don't know, maybe for super mega tan girl. I don't know. But we will try that out. Uh, just want to pronounce that uh, Kaya Cosmetics is a pretty new company. Uh, they started barely last year. Kim Kardashian, KKW Beauty, it's a company with many years experience. Uh, they are not fresh in market, but they are not old either. I think they are four years or five. I'm not sure about that. 
um, if we can talk about uh, KKW Beauty, they have everything what we need to create full makeup, uh, except primer, they don't have primer yet, and setting spray, but they do have, and foundation, but they do have uh, concealer, uh, powders, brightening powders, they have eyeshadow palettes, uh, they have many different uh, pens, uh, lipstick, lip pens, bronzers, highlighters, that kind of stuff. Mm, they don't have many brushes, they have some brushes but not many, but when we can talk with KK, uh, Kaya, cos oh my god, if I will make that, but when we can talk about Kaya Cosmetic, they have um, three mascara, I don't know why, they was launching two mascara later now, the newest launch is mascara number three, I don't know if we need three, uh, but this is you know, companies deal, they do what they want to do and uh, they think this is good. Uh, they have lip pen, they have lipstick, uh, they have uh, liquid lipsticks, they have normal lipsticks as well, demi matte and I think another one they are demi matte as well, so they don't have any matte lipsticks for us so far. They don't have any kind of base makeup except uh, this contour palette. Mm -hmm. And they have three eyeshadow palettes. I just buy one and two others I didn't order um, because I didn't. <laughs> From KKW Beauty, I have all eyeshadow palettes in my collection. So I think one day I will review separate video about that. Okay, so let's jump to, aha, and uh, Kaya Cosmetic, I totally forgot, they have a lot of brushes. So they have five brushes for eye look and they have a full set brushes for face. I think this is very, very nice. I have them and today we will use them for sure. So uh, for the face um, um, bronzer, I use my favorite brush from Kaya Cosmetic and this is 03 look like that, round, very soft, they have amazing brushes guys and um, I will go, as I say, medium palette from KKW Beauty I will depth with this, it's very pigmented guys, for sure I have uh, powder on me, all foundation and other stuff so I don't put bronzer on a wet base and very gently circle motions I will apply this contour palette. I mean, sorry guys. Okay, sorry guys, it was my man. Okay, so this side I think I'm done. I will not put like crazy, crazy, crazy a lot of product. I think this is what we have. It's like still I use cold shade, but it's so very warm in my opinion. It's a bit too warm for me. And I will go, I think, with the light palette, not... I think I will go with Classy. It's more lighter palette. I will just show you them together. Oh my god, I was thinking... Ow! <laughs> I was thinking like breaker. Ow, my hand. So this is how they look. Oh, maybe like that. Yeah. So this one is lighter, this one is darker. Definitely we go with this one because I'm not tan. For to apply, I, I cleaned the brush what I was using for KKW Beauty and I will use for uh, Kaya right now. If you're wondering how I clean my brushes, I always have paper with me and it's enough when you will clean really like that still you can use it for other product not always you have to wet and clean it so i think i will go with this shade in here it's too warm or maybe a little bit with this or maybe i mix them together oh and same like in another side very delicate circle motions I go with this a little bit more ashy. Yeah, I think this colder shade, it's 
better for me. So this is KK, this is Kaya. If I have to be honest, I think I like more Kaya, definitely. It just... Um, I'm, I have a little bit patchiness in here, but this is not fold of uh, palette, definitely. But I like this side. Cake, uh, Kaya Cosmetic. KKWBB. So they are very similar, but uh, I don't know. I think I like a little bit more of uh, Kaya Cosmetic. I'm a huge lover of KKW Beauty, um, but uh, I don't know. I think I like this uh, cold shade more than from KKW Beauty palette. It's just more for, for my skin tone right now, so I would just apply a bit on my nose. So let's uh, do something for fun. I think uh, I will give some points for individual products so we can say when I compare these two palettes uh, from these two companies I will give um, a star for a company who I was liking a little bit more or I think just I want to give I don't know, this is so hard, but please understand me, I really don't know how to review that, uh, how to make that uh, YouTube, maybe I should think before I start, but I think like that, no offense to any company, if I think, like I have right to do that, right, if I would think I like some product application a little bit more than other, I will give a star. Uh, and I will not give anything to other company, but it doesn't mean that company is not good because these two companies, they are high quality. It's not drugstore product 100%. So I will just say which one is the winner. Like we will have fun, right? So the winner of contouring palettes, it's Kaya. Just because we have uh, Mm, also blush inside and uh, I think I like how this shade look on me shade what I apply is from classy palette if you want to know and this is shade contour is this cold in here I mix a little bit with warm but still I apply this one and now we go to blushes I will use this blush from Kaya and this one is my favorite blush from KK I just love that shade very very much and it's different than um, Kaya Cosmetic. Kaya Cosmetic is more darker a shade than KK. So first we will go with the brush uh, and I will apply K, KK on my side. This is Lux shade. For that I use a brush from Kaya Cosmetic and this is 06. I really love that blush. It gives you like a, like a very girly, beautiful, pinky shade. It's like totally my, for my skin type. You see this patchiness in here, in here. Nothing what I can do. Okay, and we go a little bit more upper. I will apply a little bit more, guys, just to compare to products okay so this side it's kk and i clean my brush once again and i will go with kaya it's darker shade so <laughs> i can't go so deep i mean they look very similar mm, definitely a uh, kaya cosmetic have a little bit more orange like it's more peachy uh, blush even don't show in here in here it's look more no I think it is like a little bit more patch, uh, peachy and I think it has some I don't think it's totally matte because when I can see on my Face. it's not so so matte like on KKW Beauty 
and now I will tap in. So I don't know guys, I have to tell you I'm not sure about Okay, I'm in. So we can see. So I, I would tell you, okay. Okay, so about these two blushes, um, okay, this will not be easy because as I say, I love blush from KK, it give me, give me more kind of pinky, delicate uh, undertone and uh, Kaya, I don't live for that blush, I mean if I will not compare with KK, I think it's fine, but on this step, <laughs> star go to KKW Beauty, I just like more that it's matte and I like color more than I have from KK. It's look a little bit more brownish, peachy, uh, pink, not exactly shade what I wish to have. So I think the winner, K KK. <laughs> oh my gosh, that will be hard to review. Okay. We have really more stuff to show. Um, I think highlighters we left on the end and we will go with eyeshadow palettes. Hmm. So this is the thing. The first launch of Kaya Cosmetic was this palette. And this is like Bip Signature palette of Kaya Cosmetic. Look like this. Uh, I, I really was loving that palette. I, I, I mean, I still do. Um, but when she came directly, people was screaming, it's Kim Kardashian. This is what they say. And uh, I was searching from KKW Beauty two palettes actually. Oh, uh, so we have KKW Beauty in here and we have Kaya Cosmetics and we have Kaya. So yeah, actually there are some shades when they are very similar, but and they look very similar. I mean palettes, like sizes of shadows, they are exactly the same. Uh, the difference on palette is like on KKW Beauty, we don't have names on the front, we have on back side, I hate that. On Kaya Cosmetic we have names in here, um, not back side, so this is big plus in my opinion both palettes they have mirror both they are neutral um let's make some swatches so first i was thinking like classic blossom can be a little bit on similar vibes but when i look now on this one and this is a classic uh, Kaya Lulu KK uh, palette. I think definitely we can find more similar shades. Uh, so, how to check them for you? Wait. Everyone can create almost similar shadows, guys. It's so hard. It's so many shadows, so many out of the palettes on beauty in industry, on the market. Then to make something new, impossible. This is just what I want to tell you. I guess this YouTube review will be long. I, I think almost 40 minutes or 40 minutes. So, which I'm sorry for that, but let's compare. So I will do some swatches. So I think I will swatch from this palette. It is New York, this kind of copper uh, shade because on this palette, it's very similar this one in here, but I don't know which shade is that it's signed, signed? or this is signed. Chicago, I don't know, I cannot read behind, so I will swatch this shade for you. So like we can see. They look both like that, they are very similar. 
like very we will see on swatches so this one it's Kaya cosmetic Whoa. so beautiful so beautiful and this one in here it's KKW beauty but my hand is not straight so 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 this is KKW beauty I will show you a little bit closer oh so KK definitely it's more kind of lighter goldish uh, brownish shade from Kaya cosmetic it's totally different in my opinion they look very similar but it's darker more copper in my opinion so they are not the same also the feeling of shadows it's not the same quality at all um Kim Kardashian it's uh, KK it's uh, more kind of dry and uh, Kaya it's more creamy on this specific two shades okay you know guys when I look on them when they lay down on my table actually they look almost the same like really almost the same look there is many shades like they look the same okay so when we can look on these two palettes they look pretty similar when i was looking on table i think like, wait, wait 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 so first of all when we go with the lightest shades both palettes they have very similar lighter shades lighter shimmers in here also i know everyone can create similar but so look uh, then we have this brownie shadow and this one they are very similar to this one uh, when we can uh, check this shade in here it's very similar to this one this shade is very similar to this one uh, this uh, shade it's very similar to this one this one to this one um, it's still a couple of shades when they are not working together i mean they are not similar but it's kind of you know, some similar shades so yeah but let's swatch them now now i think i will swatch these two light shimmers in here because i really want to know uh how they perform so this is kaya shade i'm very pale guys so you will not see that and this is kk Oh, so they are totally not the same you will not see that camera will not show you this is KK it's more kind of warm and this is Kaya more colder undertone so we don't they are they don't look the same for sure so this is Kaya cosmetic and this is KK totally two different shades in my opinion Kaya they are more creamy uh, than KKW Beauty and we have also these two brown shades what I want to swatch for you so this how they look very similar and now I will swatch them in here so this is Kaya this is Kim they are not the same definitely this one more cold and darker and this one is more warm a little bit lighter shade so in here it is Kaya and in here we have KK I think mats they swatch better from uh, KKW Beauty if I have to be honest with you so once again they are totally not the same they look similar on panel but on swatches they are not the same okay range point swatches shimmers win Kaya cosmetic but mats definitely go to KKW Beauty in my opinion so we have point point for both palettes now application so i will apply on me we will start first with this side which is kkw beauty i will use for that kkw beauty brush as well and this is one of my favorite brushes i use that brush every day and this is not even for eyeshadow this is for brightening and concealer <laughs> 
but it's my favorite brush she have like thousand years yep okay so I will dip to um, I think like standard with this warm shade in here and I will let that on my crease I will not go with anything crazy guys because you know it's just comparing product it's not like totally reviewing something uh, I just want to create on both eye the same look so okay I think they are very nice pigmented then definitely Mm, I really like KK uh, eyeshadows. They are nice pigmented, guys. Mm -hmm. Okay, and I'm actually finishing here, if I have to be honest with you, with this shade. Yes. And now I will go with something dark. Now I think I will try this shade in here. And I will focus more on the corner of my eyes Exactly in here just to dark this a bit more So I think that's it really mm -hmm. And now we go and now I want to try this light shade, like this is my favorite kind of eye look, what I used to do when I go work and I really want to compare this to light shade. I love them from KKW Beauty but I don't remember how they was on my eyelids from Kaya Cosmetics so we will try that out and I will left in here. So I love to bright my eyelids with this shade. If we can say about KKW Beauty, they are very pigmented, so it's like a concealer, like you really bright this out. I love it. And I loved shade also from, from them. I'm done. I have to just apply product, product lower my lash and I will go, I think, with this the darkest shade from Palette. Just like that and now same brush I will go with this lighter shade in here just to apply closer to my nose and I will blend all this a bit together so I'm really done now I have to copy this on another side for that for that I will use um, brushes from uh, Kaya Cosmetics. Okay, and we go to Kaya Cosmetics. So definitely I will go with this shade like my transit one as I did with another side. So So as far now I can see, uh, side with KK was a little bit darker than from Kaya, but you know, it's beautiful also. Very, very nice shade. They blend really good, guys, really. And now also I will go I think I will go a little bit with this one. And there. Hmm. And now we go to the darkness shade. It's this one in here. And it's a lot of pigment there. It's really fast eye look, guys. I 
will not do anything long in here okay i clean brush from kk and i will depth with this light shade in here uh, so And now I go with the darkest shade in here. Ooh, it is dark. Mm -hmm. Nice. And this lighter to connecting from the nose and we are actually very very close to finish this is my very often day I look this is how I apply so both today work similar I think Kaya is more warmer palette than classic palette from KKW Beauty in my opinion definitely but blend beautiful like now I have to give range point and this is problem I love eyeshadow palettes guys I really love uh, I don't need foundation I just love to buy eyeshadow palettes so we can say like that I love Kim Kardashian. I love K KKW Beauty. It's my number one brand. But to be really honest, this is honest review. Um, I give point to Kaya Cosmetic. I'm not disappointed. I just love KKW Beauty. <laughs> to not give them, it's big disappointment. But I think definitely this shadows blend much faster than on KK side and they are a little bit more pigmented and they work amazing together I don't say KK don't do that but uh, on that kind of level I think I will give the star to, K, uh, to Kaya Cosmetic lipsticks I just got today uh, I didn't try Kaya Cosmetic lipsticks and the lip pens I just received them today that's why I make this tutorial. They are the lightest, I think. My lips are <laughs> salt. No. Uh, this shade is Brie. Wait. The lighter shade is Breeze. It's this one in here. And the darker is Colorado. We will swatch them here. This is how it looks swatches. This one is lighter, this one is darker, I mean this one is Colorado, no wait, this one is Breeze, this one is Colorado, they are very dark and I have also a lip pen from KKW Beauty and this is Iconic Classic, nay, Classic Icon, Classic Icon and this is my favorite shade it's in here so be different this is KKW Beauty and this is Kaya Cosmetic they are too dark for me but we will do that review I will try out I think they are <laughs> so nice they look like a pen so let's try Kaya Cosmetic first Very nice. Mm, they look very nice, guys. Mm. 
it is very similar like my lips uh, color i mean i'm sorry for my lips they are so dry uh but it could be a little bit lighter please i hope kaya if one day will saw my tutorial can make more nude neutral light shades because those they are i'm sorry because those they are too dark But you know guys, I did upper, but lower we go with KK. We will just try that, what do you think? There is different for sure. As I say, this from KK is my favorite one because it's light, but it's more brownish one and Kaya Cosmetic, it's more my lip shade. So I think I will put star to this one. I, I mean, I don't want to say like, I don't know how many stars I put for Kaya for how many I put for KK W Beauty, but uh, I think I like it. I like it. I like this pen, uh, I like color, I like how look on my lips, it looks like my lips actually, it doesn't show like, uh, because when I apply KK it's very kind of creamy, but not like very, it's like a creamy and I see on my lips, but KK have, uh, but Kaya Cosmetic have different mm, it is creamy, but also a little bit more matte. I don't know how to explain to you. This one, I feel more like lipstick. This one, like my skin. So star for this lip liner. Mm -hmm. And now we go with lipsticks and we will compare them for you. In here, I have two lipstick from KKW Beauty. One is creamy, one is more matte and we will see how look this one i have shade in here it's honey elixir hmm. interesting i hope it's not too dark for me okay look nice i mean dark but as i say we, they don't have lighter it's the lightest shade and then it's flying kiss another one oh that's dark that's dark so first I will show you two shades. I will swatch them first. Okay, they are not so pigmented. Hmm. I don't know if I will use that lipstick. Maybe I will do giving away because I show you. I will never use that lipstick. This is two lipstick from KKW from Kaya Cosmetic. As you see, this one it's so dark, and this other one probably I will use it. I just swatch now. So, so I think I will not swatch this one, guys. I will let. Who knows? Maybe, maybe I will do giving away, and someone can have it. And this one is the shade. Yeah, flying kiss. Uh, oh, that's interesting. When you open them, you have 18 months to use it. On other products, very often you have barely 12. Yeah, so on KKW Beauty, you have 12 months. So you have four longer. And we can compare. Okay, I will put this back. I don't want to touch too much. Already we have one lipstick from Kaya, so it's enough, I think. Um, so let's compare okay so this how they look Ding. it's look amazing but 
by the way first time I see this lipstick on my hands because I never had this lipstick before I think it's very nice look on this gold detail Kaya logo I love that logo I like also a color of that lipstick and uh, some people say about KKW Beauty it looks like a chip. It's not. I think it's very cool. Look on them. They look very interesting. Both of them, they have very similar shape, uh, but definitely Kaya, they are bigger. I don't know if we can say they look same because in my opinion, they don't. Both they have similar shape. Like Kaya have like signature nice, like a peachy nude uh, color of products and KKW Beauty also, but a little bit more beige than peachy, so I don't say they are the same. I don't think so. As we can see, shades. Uh, definitely, KK is too dark for me also, uh, so I think Kaya will be very dark as well. But this is weird, when I swatch Kaya, Okay, look guys, this is swatches. This is KKW Beauty. It's uh, more pigment and they are more creamy. And Kaya Cosmetic, they are more like a lip glosses. It's not so much pigment in here. That's weird. I never saw that kind of swatch and that kind of lipstick. Mm. On the upper part. Mm. That's freaking beautiful. That's so beautiful. No. Uh. That look like my lips. I'm shocked. Mm. And they have smell, beautiful, delicate smell. Oh my god, I love how my lips look. And now we will go to KKW Beauty. There is one thing what I don't like with KKW Beauty lipstick or lip glosses or general or lipstick. They don't have any smell. They smell like pure lipstick, you know, like an old lady lipstick. Uh, this is what I just want to say. And then it's a lot of pigment. They are very creamy, a lot of pigment. Which is really fine. I cannot touch them together. Well, okay, this is easy. I already know which lipstick I like more. This is how they look on my lips. The point star, big star, go to Kaya Cosmetic again because few reasons. First of all, I love the application. I love how nice, moisturized that lipstick is. It look like my lips have a little bit like a glow and have beautiful smell. Also packet look stunning, very luxury. I love it. I love everything about that lipstick. I do recommend, once again, this is Honey Elixir shade on me. Uh, star don't go to Kiki Double Beauty just because um, don't have any smell. I, I feel smell like a lipstick, like a older lipstick on lips, but it's not old, you know, this is just what KK, I guess, don't like, they don't like lip, lipstick smells, I don't know, uh, so I don't like that, and uh, I think definitely I like a little bit better um, feeling on lips with uh, Kaya Cosmetic, just that why uh, we have another win. Highlighters! I really like it guys okay and we go to highlighters so definitely we will go with uh, 
contour palette so what we have so we go from hmm, I don't know actually which one okay so from Kaya cosmetic I will go with uh, a classy palette I will apply with Kaya uh, highlighter um, with the brush 08 and we go with this shading here very nice goldy champagne delicate shade very nice left like kind of healthy skin you see beautiful mm -hmm. on another side we will go with palette uh, this is uh, light and i will go with this shade in here i don't remember actually what shade is that also nice but more cold I don't want to repeat over and over the same but I think I will go to medium palette and I will go with the gold in here we will just try to make this work Give me something more warm because it's ashy. I'm cold. The star go to Kaya side. I'm tired, guys. By the way, it's uh, it's very late and uh, yeah, but I like my lips. The star go to Kaya side because it's more kind of wet finish. That's what I see. It's more warm. It's more what I like with uh, KKW Beauty. It's more kind of powdery a highlighter. It's very nice, but I think it's too ashy for my uh, skin type. I just think like that. Uh, and I try two palettes, so these two palettes don't offer any darkener highlighter. I think medium should have a little bit more darkener. Uh, Kaya have a little bit more options. I think these two palettes for me to work with the blushes, with contour and with highlighter. So definitely end up end when we compare all palettes, I give star to Kaya. Whew. Okay guys, I think we finished that challenge. I'm impressed of new brand like Kaya Cosmetic on Swedish market and uh, it's just really exciting to buy products from Kaya because they look so 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 nice. The quality is also really good. Um, but I don't say KKWBD is not good, it's also very good. They are both very high quality products and also prices they are high. So um, yeah, that's it guys. I'm done this tutorial. Let me know what do you think. Let me know if you was trying Kaya Cosmetic before. What is your opinion? Which product you was liking? Which one you didn't? Uh, for me, so far, all Kaya Cosmetic products work very nicely. Uh, and um, yeah, I wait for more. Definitely, I wait for more nude lipsticks. Uh, because I like this one, but I wish to have also a little bit lighter. Like I say, I'm, I need lighter lipstick. So KKW Beauty offer lighter shades as well. So I think we should have that too. Okay, it was a lot of talking, guys. Thank you so much for being with me if you survived to the end. So see you on my next tutorial. Don't forget to like my video and subscribe my YouTube channel for more. Love you guys. Mwah. Take care. Bye-bye.